All right, former BCCI President AC Mutaya was speaking to us exclusively. Uh, we are back online with him. Also joining us is our consulting editor Boria Majumdar and a few of our guests in the studio. Uh, Mr. Mutaya, if you can hear me now, what uh, Boria was asking was, you suggested Shashank Manoha's name, but don't you think that the BCCI will never accept him because he has openly questioned Srinivasan in the past? Uh, Boria, do you think that it is uh, abs or nearly impossible that everyone in the BCCI will come to an agreement and say, let Shashank Manoha take over, even though he has a very clean image and he's been uh, known to be a very able administrator, but it's unlikely that will happen, you're saying? You know, I'm saying as long as Srinivasan is in the saddle, it's not going to happen. And I'm making myself very blunt. If, if you ask me, I, I more or less uh, know the inside workings of the BCCI having spoken to a lot of people. There are, there are a majority of members who want Shashank Manohar. Don't, don't uh, uh, say that, I mean, we can't say that a uh, majority of the BCCI members don't want him. They do. But as far as Srinivasan is concerned or his camp is concerned, they will oppose him tooth and nail. I mean, there is no question, the last person Srinivasan would want to see at the helm of affairs is Shashank Manohar. Because you can be ensured, if Shashank Manohar takes over, there will be a cleanup. If Shashank Manohar takes over, he'll appoint CBI. He'll say, let the CBI take over investigation. He's already told you uh, yesterday, Shivani, on headlines today, that in that statement that he wants a CBI investigation. He said that IPL season 7 should be suspended. He said that matches cannot move to the UAE. If Shashank Manohar takes over, all of these things will happen. Srinivasan cannot afford that. So the last person who Srinivasan will accept, uh, as Dr. Muthaya was proposing, is Shashank Manohar. Chetan Chahan, former Indian cricketer, is also joining us in the studio. Nikhil Chopra is still with us and also senior journalist Pradeep Magazine. Chetan, I want to take your reaction first. Supreme Court again coming down very heavily, talking of the conflict of interest that goes from the top to the bottom. Even Indian captain Mahindra Singh Dhoni's name has come and uh, the petitioners have argued that uh, he has you know, behaved in a corrupt manner and given a false statement. So even questions on the Indian captain and the entire structure of the BCCI right now under N. Srinivasan. Well, see, there are many, many issues in, in, involved here. One is that uh, the players are involved in fixing, betting and, or, and whatever. That is one part. Part two is players getting involved. That's part two. Third, which is the most important thing, and that is the fair name, the good name of cricket is getting spoiled. The BCCI itself is also under uh, question. The officials of the BCCI are under question. IPL franchises owners, they are also under question. This is a great opportunity for the BCCI to clean its house. And I think the BCCI should accept this as a challenge. People are not in, in, important. Individuals are not important. Individuals will come and go. The BCCI will stay on. The cricket is going to stay on. The game is going to stay on. This is the right time. Find the right person. Whoever is the person, find the right person and clean up everything. That is <coughs> what cricketers want. That is what the people, uh, the fans want. And that is what the people of India want. All right, let's go back across to AC Mataya. I believe the line has been patched once again with him. Mr. Mataya, if you can hear me, the question we were trying to ask you is that you've suggested Shashank Manohar's name, but will everyone in the BCCI who still, you know, uh, uh, are under N. Srinivasan, and will N. Srinivasan himself agree to his name, knowing that Shashank Manohar has uh, spoken out against him in the past? Once N. Srinivasan steps down, where is the question of his influence in BCCI? I think then the BCCI will wake up and take a stand. You see, N. Uh, the, uh, Sashank Manohar would be the right choice and I would strongly recommend that he takes over. Uh, and I strongly recommend, I, uh, I request the Board of uh, Control for Cricket in India to support his name. I don't know how you say, how Borea, how are you saying that uh, Srinivasan will still have an influence once he steps down? All right, uh, AC Mutaya there. Me? Yes, sir, we could hear you. Thanks a lot for joining us. Uh, appreciate your comments on today's developments. You're saying the BCCI will wake up the moment N. Srinivasan removes his seat. And they will perhaps not have an issue with even Shashank Manoha taking uh, over as interim president. We'll have to wait and see. So far, 
you know, the BCCI's reactions have been on the expected lines, uh, that it's in the court, uh, let the court decide, we'll see what the order is, uh, and so on and so forth. Uh,